day has passed, it does not longer exist. What remains of it? Nothing but a story. If stories were not told, the world would live like animals just for the day. Today we live, tomorrow we are a story. The whole world is nothing but a long, long story. What is life, really? The future is not here yet and you can't know what will happen. The present is just the short now. And the past is one long, beautiful story. Grown-ups and children long to listen to stories. You know, in all countries, kings and presidents make wars. That's a lot of stories, unfortunately. Architects dig out old cities. Astronomers discover stars, planets, and galaxies. In all countries, they build railroad stations and airports and museums, libraries. A lot of stories. Human beings can't forget their past. Should not forget their past. If you forget your past, you also forget the mistakes from the past, and then you will do them all over again and again and again and again. The world of stories becomes richer, more complex, and multicultural. You know, you and me, and all of us, we die. But that doesn't put an end to the world of stories. The whole world, all the planets, the stars, and the galaxies contain one divine story, one source of life, one wonderfully, beautifully, everlasting story that only God or the gods know at its full length. Maybe. Goodbye.